In this video, we will talk about 5 things Siamese cats hate. If you have a Siamese cat, you would have noticed your Siamese cat hates all or some of the things on this list. If you're thinking about adopting a Siamese cat, this list should give you an idea of what to expect. But first, if you would like to keep getting useful tips and guides about your dogs or cats, then don't forget to subscribe to our channel, because we constantly bring you useful info that will help you be a better pet owner. Let's get started. 1. They hate being ignored. The very loving character of the Siamese cat may be a concern, since Siamese cats are known to get too obsessed on their owners and do not fare well when left alone. If this happens frequently enough, they may develop depression and anxiety. They can sometimes become too concentrated on a single member of the family. If you're going to be gone for a while, give your cat some things to keep them occupied, such as interactive toys, window perches and cadios, and even recordings of your voice or calming music. If you can, play with them before you go to tire them out and promote napping while you're gone. Don't get a Siamese if you want a cat who doesn't care if you exist or not. They appear to require more attention and devotion than the majority of dogs. If you don't offer your cat what he or she considers adequate attention, you will undoubtedly pay the price in poor cat behavior. This breed is also known for becoming enraged if you don't pay attention to them, which may explain why they have a bad reputation for being mean. 2. They hate being quiet. This might just be an exaggeration, but Siamese cats hate being quiet. They have a reputation for being talkative and boisterous, which some people find charming while others find annoying. This breed is known for its talkativeness and vocality. They have a peculiar low-pitched meow dubbed the Amazer that they use to communicate. Their harsh meows can be annoying at times, and some people liken them to a baby's incessant wailing. Their vocalizations are sometimes unpleasant, relentless, and annoying. If you want a peaceful and quiet pet, a Siamese is not the breed for you. Siamese cats meow for everything, even when they are hungry or seek attention in the middle of the night. 3. They hate feeling challenged. Siamese cats are extremely territorial and will hate feeling challenged. Siamese cats also have a need to be dominant, which may be a problem. The Siamese is a naturally intelligent cat that can perceive fear or subservience in other cats. The Siamese then hunts that cat down in order to establish territory and control. The innate jealousy of Siamese cats is linked to this cat behavior trait. This is a cat breed that craves to be the center of attention in all situations, and it will bully other animals to get it. If you punish them for being territorial, they may grow more aggressive, so try as often as possible to pay visits to other Siamese cat owners, and begin socializing your Siamese cat as soon as you can. 4. They hate boredom. If you work full-time and still want a Siamese, consider buying two so that they'll have each other while you're gone. Because this breed is prone to boredom, make sure you provide them with plenty of toys, a scratching post, and cat climbing equipment. They enjoy making up their own games and climbing. They've been known to hide on top of the refrigerator or a shelf and pounce on unsuspecting bystanders. The Siamese is a smart, quick, athletic cat who enjoys playing. Keep his mind occupied with puzzle toys and his body active with chaseable teaser toys and a large cat tree to climb. If you leave him without any sort of entertainment, you could regret it when you get home. 5. They hate being kept indoors completely. Though Siamese cats are a little clumsy and not always the best candidates for going outside on their own, leaving them inside is only asking for trouble. They like investigating and will get their noses and paws into whatever they can get their hands on. They appreciate fresh air and prefer being outside, therefore if you have an outdoor cat, it will explore every nook and crevice of your yard, as well as the gardens of your neighbors. Indoor Siamese cats may grow bored and neurotic if there isn't enough to keep them engaged, so if you plan on keeping them indoors completely, make sure they have plenty to do. Otherwise, they'll merely dig up your carpets and rip holes in your furniture to pass the time, the scratching posts are a must. They don't enjoy being confined and can learn to open doors with lever handles if they're large enough. An open window will also present a challenge and an opportunity to a Siamese cat. A challenge to the escapist part of its character and an opportunity to have some fun. 
The bottom line is, it's a good idea to learn some of the things Siamese cats hate, before making a commitment to this wonderful breed. Overall, Siamese cats typically have a lot of needs and do best with owners who are willing to dedicate time and patience. So, do you own a Siamese cat? What do they hate? Please comment below.